Just a quick, quick question for you guys. Um, yeah. Now, without the conversions API, what percentage of purchases are you potentially missing out on? Ooh, that's a good question. Oh, yeah. It would be a lot. Like twenty percent, would you say? Yeah. I mean, if if I look at bigger spending accounts where we also have like a high ROS, like yeah. Facebook misses fifty five percent, like half of it. Right. Like, for example, I don't know, like in reality, maybe 2,500 orders in a month, but Facebook only shows 1,200. Right. It's just, of course, if you spend, spend less, it's going to be less description because there's, you know, less happening on the site. It's just like you want to give yourself a head start because we know it's a problem. We know we have to deal with it. So you might as well do as much as you can to do get visibility. Same as with like UTMs. Yes, you know, having to go to analytics, will it be accurate? No, but it is again an extra avenue for you to watch. Bit on for you. One of our client accounts yesterday that's got high rows. Three leads have come through the Facebook ads manager. And in high rows, we can see 17. So you know, that's <laughs> it's quite a Quite Quite a lot of uh, leads that aren't coming through. With that said, with this client, we know that Hyros is all set up correctly. So we're not as strict on making sure that the tracking is set up through Facebook uh, anymore because we sort of rely heavily on Hyros anyway. But, you know, yeah, it is a big a big amount of data or a large amount of data that you are losing out on um, without it, any additional trackers. It makes it hard to kind of track the efficiency of your campaigns if there's such a big discrep discrepancy, right? Yeah, 100%. Even like things like CBO, it's it's so difficult because Facebook are basically just allocating budget to um, ad sets and ads that Facebook thinks are performing well, when in reality, you know, uh, an additional tracker might be showing completely different numbers and, you know, Facebook are just chucking money at ads that might not necessarily be profitable. So um, when you, for the clients that we are, you know, using additional trackers for more often than not, it's like very manual ABO, no dynamic creatives, nothing like that. Just so that we've, we're in control again and we can, you know, make the changes rather than Facebook. Hi there guys, hope you're doing well. And if you are seeing this, that means you've made it to the end of the video. So thank you so much for watching. And that was basically a snippet of a one-time event where we basically went in analyze your ad accounts and uh, answered any questions that you had completely free of charge no strings attached so if you want to join something like this there's nothing really like this on the cards anytime soon however we do have a coaching program where we do exactly this so not only do we show you exactly you know how we've been able to generate multiple six figures with our agencies generate hundreds and hundreds of appointments per month for ourselves as well as our coaching students, but we'll also answer all of your questions, analyze your client's ad accounts, and also share our screens and show you exactly how we're generating leads for our own agency, how we're generating sales for our you know, e-commerce stores, our own clients, and so on and so forth. So if that sounds interesting to you, I will leave a few resources in the first comments of this video. One of them will be Erwin's own YouTube channel, so feel free to check that out and subscribe to his channel. Uh, the other one will be the link to the free agency scale and fast track Facebook group. And the third one will be to book a free call with one of us or so, you know, basically someone on our team, no external sales guy, not like that. It will be someone on the team, either myself, either Erwin, Brandon or Elliot. We will go over where you're currently at with your agency and then see if we can come up with a game plan to get you up to six figures and beyond as well and you know the best way of, uh, of doing so. So if that sounds interesting to you, it'll all be linked in the first comment down below. But for now, I'll wrap up this video here. Thank you so much for watching. Like, share, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Yeah.